Now that we've created all our horizontal geometry, let's take a look at how we can review that geometry. There's a tool inside of Open Roads Designer called Open Roads Model Explorer. This tool can be used to browse and manage the data in the design file. You can also use it to search, zoom to, and isolate data. So to get to the Open Roads Model Explorer, we have to go to the Home tab. We'll click on Explorer. That'll open up the Explorer tools here over on the left-hand side of the screen. And we want to go to the Open Roads Model tab and expand it. And here, the Open Roads Model is broken up into different categories for how the data is organized in, in the DGN file. So we've, we've created some geometry so far and an alignment. So if we go to the alignment category and we expand that, you'll see it shows us our feature definition that we used for our geometry. If we expand that by left clicking the arrow, you'll also see we have an alignment or complex element called London Road. If we click that, notice it highlights and selects it in, in our view. And if I want to dig deeper to see what elements make up this particular alignment, I can left click on the arrow to expand the group and see all the geometric pieces that make up our complex element or our horizontal alignment of London Road. So geometric elements associated with the alignments are basically all grouped under the alignments category. Another thing we can do is if you right click, you also get access to additional tools that are related to the geometry. Okay, continuing on here in exercise number two, now is probably a good time to talk about how we create a horizontal alignment report. And we already have our Open Roads Model Explorer open, and we have our alignment already highlighted. So we can just easily go over here, select the alignment, right click on it, and we have access to some other tools. Now the tool we want to use to create the report or view the report is the Horizontal Geometry Report tool. So we're going to click on that. That's going to open up another window called the Bentley Civil Report Browser, and that has our alignment report displayed in the window here. So let's take a look at that and review some of the formatting here. It looks like there's some things in there that we want to change. So in order to change the formatting, all we have to do is go up into the Tools, Format Options, and what I'm going to do is adjust some of the precision in the format uh, in the report. So I'm going to change the angular precision to just zero. I'm going to change the angular format to degrees, minutes, and seconds. I'm going to change the slope precision to two decimal places and the slope format to be percent. And I also want to adjust the stationing precision in the stationing format. So I'm going to go down to the station category, change the stationing precision to two decimal places and the stationing format to SS plus SS dot SS. And then down in the directional uh, precision and format, I'm going to change that as well. So I'm going to change the direction precision to just zero and then the directional format to degrees, minutes, and seconds. And then I'm going to close. So let's review the report to ensure the formatting has been set properly. Looks like it has. So now at this point we may want to save the report. So we're going to go up to file and we're going to say save as. And I'm going to change my directory here so that I can go save it under the quick start for Open Roads Designer Geometry. I also want to save it as a .doc file type. And the name we're going to give it is HR for Horizontal Report London Road. And this we're going to click Save. You can also print the file by going up to File and Print. Now, whenever you create a horizontal geometry report, the default report type that comes up is the horizontal alignment review report. If you notice over here on the left hand side of the screen, we have various other report types that are available to us. And notice they have a .xsl extension. These are known as style sheets. And each style sheet contain the formatting for how the report is displayed. So if you want to see a different type of display of your alignment data, 
all you have to do is select a different report type or style sheet to adjust the display in the civil report browser window. So let's take a look at just the horizontal alignment check integrity tool as an example. Click on horizontal alignment check integrity and notice the display changes. Also take a look at the horizontal alignments table. Notice how the display changes. So you can see all these different report types adjust the display and the formatting of the horizontal report. Once you're done reviewing the reports, we can close the civil report browser and deselect our alignment by left clicking anywhere in the view. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you and see you next time.